hey y'all so i was like oh weekend energy let's get it popping so i'm gonna really try to do a variety here we're gonna see what comes out but i'm trying to like cover all aspects of the weekend read so um let's see what we pick up on this is a general reading okay it may or may not resonate with you take what you need leave what you don't okay don't be trying to make it fit if it ain't you it ain't you we're gonna keep it kicking okay so uh how y'all doing i'm awesome amazing superb wonderful great just all the way around just great and wonderful and um yeah let's get in let's 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 hop on in let's hop in let's hop in i do want to exp extend my love and light to you guys i hope everything is going great and um gratitude and appreciation as well thank you for your likes shares comments truly appreciate it but let's hop in so i'm sorry also i created my own instagram shay the goddess okay i don't know how to put it in the description box i'm gonna try to figure it out but it will be in the description box or the message box. All my personal information if you would like to book a read with me. Um, if you need any, if you have any questions, it will be somewhere in the comment section or the description box, okay? So, moving forward. Let's hop in. So, music. Ooh. Teaching and learning. Okay. What else? Abundance. Hello. That was at the bottom of the deck too. With financial discipline as well. So in nature. Can I get one more? Ooh, I got two more. I'm gonna take those, put those back. But this is domestic harmony and surrender. So it's just time for you to um come into full balance and complete balance. This could be like a some type of relationship to balance it out or this could be a relationship with yourself healing this is what i'm saying like you you doing the work so good job good job high five Woo! um it needs to surrender if you haven't been doing the work it's time to really go in man that pluto in retrograde and then the um full moon and and scorpio Ugh. you're gonna be you're gonna be getting some healing is <laughs> it you're not gonna have a choice okay um I did want one more. Can I get one more? Thank you. And synchronicity. Okay. So, change at the bottom of the deck. Change is coming, of course, with time out over our energy. I'm seeing creativity. Change, creativity, all that great stuff. And environment change your environment change the people that you are around just change if it's making you feel uncomfortable change it change your mindset change how you see things I see that you might be getting downloads or receiving messages through music um, also you guys are like kind of wrapping up some kind of cycles here with the teaching and learning card um, karmic cycles things that you have to learn to get through the next phase the next phase which would be abundance hello i received that and then nature maybe you guys need to get out and maybe do like a little walk um do like a walk get out into nature pay attention to the signs of synchronicities because that's here as well um yeah see that oh that's better anyway yeah that's better um pay attention to the signs and synchronicities um i feel like through music and through nature they might be trying to um get your attention they might be trying to uh show you some things as far as when teaching and learning um that's better i like that all the way i mean y'all can't see it but it's just it just looks good you know what i'm saying okay we got messages go into this music card for me yep woman holding a coin somebody is doing the work darling okay yes woman holding a coin and then we have a broken heart and door to spirit so someone could be finding soothing messages through listening to music really trying to heal and taking some time apart um someone could be investing their time uh 
yeah this is this is like a healing energy to me through door to spirit i feel like um Someone is being divinely guided to walk away from a situation and they may be getting messages through music. Um, also, or it's just saying listen to music for messages. Tell me about teaching and learning. Teaching and learning. The angel of love. Ooh, karmic cycle. To me, that's a karmic cycle. Like all day long. Third chakra. To me, that's, that's a karmic cycle. But, um... Through love, you should be through love. It's like you becoming um, in a relationship to where uh, you are the teacher to the person that you're in a relationship with um, is what I'm getting here. Um, someone could have a lot of options here when it comes to love or someone could be had someone could have a passion with teaching and learning is also what I'm getting someone could have a passion with teaching and learning this is spirit saying go ahead and invest yourself and um invest into um teaching and learning spiritually is what I'm getting tell me about abundance why is abundance here give me something good I'll take like a happy family or something that'd be great so Yep, the moon goddess tried to come out. So with the moon goddess here in the yin and yang, um, this is you coming to complete full balance. And this is also you creating your abundance. Yes, okay. This weekend, this is what you be working towards creating your abundance. Maybe some couple of you guys will be doing vision boards. I don't know what you're doing, okay. But just um, standing in your purpose and your truth, creating what is meant for you. Um, that's what the focus is. Um Maybe you guys will be going on taking some walks and really clearing your mind and your heart moving forward. Uh, what else? The thinking woman in nature. This is what I'm saying. So it's really time for you to get out. Maybe you need to go sit in nature and get grounded and um, take your journal with you and really write down and plan out what it is that you want moving forward so you can create what it is that you want. I did see creativity at the bottom end of the deck. Also time for you to rest and rejuvenate and um, watch how you communicate with people because the fifth chakra is here. So instead of rest and rejuvenate in the fifth chakra. So instead of being very voice, using your voice, being very boisterous, you want to hold back and um, more so do a lot of listening and see how your inner you is guiding you to move forward right because this could be causing you a lot of anxiety here is what i'm getting tell me about synchronicity action it's time for you to take action on the synchronicities that you're seeing right with the sun and financial constraints i feel like you're someone could be feeling like you know what i don't really have the finances but you're coming up as a queen of pentacles it might not be here in the physical but all you have to do is manifest it is what it's saying because you are full of abundance so um i feel like this is spirit saying you need to start taking action. Screw the financial constraints. Every time you spend money, say, um, I received this back tenfold. I don't know. Um, but that's what it's saying. It's time for you to take a journey. Hello? Stop, stop, stop. Doubting yourself. This is someone who is looking at the beauty but not going towards the beauty. Stop doubting yourself. She's at the crossroad. Don't matter which road she takes, you got the abundance. Okay? Um, as far as love and relationships are... Let's, let's hop on in. Let's get to the good stuff, right? As far as love and relationships, collective energy, please. Weekend energy. True love. Ooh, somebody who is really all into somebody wants to talk. Somebody wants to talk. Okay, 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 listen, true love, this is a romance of a lifetime, someone wants to say what's on their mind, here is what I'm getting, what else, finances and career, finances and career is, is, is real heavy right now, so someone at first probably couldn't have been given time, but this was real love situation, but they probably was holding back because they were going through some financial difficulties, and now this weekend, they may be wanting to come tell you that um, they feeling you. And they want to move forward with you. Then you have love yourself. Um, one more. Weekend energy. One more. Ooh. Getting to know each other. 
Oh, so someone been doing the work. Well, love yourself. Somebody's been doing the work. Thank you. This weekend, someone's been doing the work and someone sees that and they just so turned on by it, girl. Or, or guy, my bad. They just so turned on by you. And I feel like someone really wants to get to know you. Someone wants to express that they want to get to know you. Um, Someone could be hitting you up, letting you know what the deal is. Boo. Um, Somebody could be in separation. Someone, this could be someone that you're not talking to because they weren't giving you the time or attention because of financial situations. So this weekend, um, they could have been pouring all their heart and emotion into the finances and not really giving it to you, but they really did care about you, but they wasn't expressing it. Do you get what I'm saying? They was holding that back. Um, and I feel like somebody wants to come in and, and say, can I talk to you? I really want to meet you. However the song go. Really want to know you. Mm -hmm. Y'all know what I'm saying. Um, but yeah, you guys might be in separation. And um, at first you probably was trying to make the effort. You probably end up walking away. Whatever situation is, however it resonates with you, boo. Do you. Okay? Um, so, I do want to see what you guys need to surrender to at this time too. During this weekend, which I need to focus on. If y'all doing some healing. Right? Oh, someone could be moving. Good job. Someone could keep moving or maybe leaving the situation with the environment card here and financial discipline. Oh, my goodness. If somebody got, um, it's feeling like they have to move because they don't have money to pay rent. Oh, I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. I am so sorry. And I hope everything works out for you. Okay. What is it you need to turn to? Should have probably did this before the love oracle. But we're just going to pull like three. Can I get two more? Procrastination. Stop procrastinating. Stop it. Complete healing. And silence. This is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. If you're procrastinating, at least procrastinate the right way. Go within. Do meditation. Don't be sitting there talking about something I'm putting. Stop putting stuff off. That's what that's saying. Listen to your intuition. Allow it to guide you. Guide you. Um. Stop procrastinating though. It's time to make moves. Don't worry. I was in procrastination energy for a long time. Okay? Spirit got me together real quick. I was like, we need you to do X, Y, and Z. And what you tripping on? Got me all the way together. Okay? Um, I wanted to touch bases back on the environment and the moving. Because um, this is affecting your health. Okay? This is affecting your health. And I feel like you're having the signs. You're having the signs. This is intuition. You're having the signs. They're trying to communicate with you and tell you what to do. But since you're all stressed out, you're not listening to your intuition. They're trying to um, end cycles. This is the rebirth card. Karmic completion. You get what I'm saying? What is it that you're manifesting while you're completing a, while you're doing this completion, right? What is it that you're manifesting while you're doing this completion with karmic completions and rebirth? Um, it's, 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 it's a shift. It's a shift for a reason. It's a shift for a reason. I can't tell you this enough. It's a shift for a reason so allow things to shift just go with the flow <clears throat> become i just seen like um you flowing like um fluidity like water moving and you are the water so the water the intuition like allow it to guide you through this hard time um yeah something is wrapping up karmic completion is here so don't trip okay do not trip. Everything is going to work out. But while you're completing cycles, what is it that you're manifesting? What is it? Like, how are you in forgiveness? And somebody could be going through a breakup. You get what I'm saying? Relationship change. Listen. Listen. Shit happens. Shit happens. But this ain't the time for you to be soaking in your own energy, okay? Especially not right now. If you got to move, if you going through some shit and you got to move or somebody got to move or they ain't got money, this is not the time to soak and sit in, okay? It's not. It's not the time. This is not the time. We need you to put your game face on. You Get your head in the game. There we go. I'm going like this. Get your head in the game and let's get it moving, okay? You got this is what I'm saying. You got this. Whoever this is for, you got it. Um, surrender procrastination. Surrender procrastination. Oh, stop procrastinating. Start doing. Start doing. Stop procrastinating. It's time to heal. It's time to let it go. If it's not working, it ain't working. We moving forward. And then surrender to silence. It's better to not say anything. Hold back. Go within. Center yourself. Ground yourself. And then move forward is what this is saying. Um... 
this is what this is saying. I feel like someone needs to surrender to like stop fighting. And this is your intuition again. So, so anyways, let's hop in real quick. Um, can we get weekend energy? I'm trying to make this video short. Okay. Can we get weekend energy? Please. This is the shadow keepers. What's this? Spell keepers. Oh, spellcasters to row, okay? Spellcasters to row. Yes, you read these in reverse, but I don't. It's a new deck. Gotta get acclimated. So, tell me what it is. Tell me what it is. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, Queen of Swords, Eight of Wands. Seen the wheel, I think. Ooh. The Hangman. This is what I'm saying. Someone's... Someone's um, at a standstill right now. Someone's caught up. Things aren't moving forward. <clears throat> Things are trying to move forward, but it needs to be a shift of perspective here is what I'm getting. Um, this weekend, I need you guys to work on changing your perspective, perspective and how you are viewing things and how you are experiencing things. All this mat matters when you're manifesting what it is that you truly want. All this matters. Um, with the Nine of Swords here, this is someone who's very under a lot of stress, right? That's, that's probably why they had me go in. Um, this is someone who's under a lot of stress. But this cycle is wrapping up. It's just all here. It's all mental with the Nine of Swords. This is all mental. It's all mental. It's like, I feel like you're in the energy. Like, I'm manifesting. What am I doing? But look at the sun behind you. You're focused on the wrong thing. Change your perspective. Okay? That's the title. Change your perspective. Um... Look, with the world is the Ace of Cups and then the sun and then the fucking sun. Thank you. This is a, a new emotional fulfillment. That is like you've healed. You've done the work. It's, it's just awesome. OK, um, with the hangman here, the eight of wands. So I feel like someone is slowly but surely moving out of this energy with the hangman here. But it's still they still have to surrender and change their first. I said surrender. And then the hangman is the first card out. OK, to work with me. The, the hangman is the first card out. This is you needing to change your perspective and surrender. This man. Look at this. He all ain't getting out of there until something change. Until something change. Okay. Hmm, that's interesting. That's interesting. But anyways, moving forward. You know, this is a new deck. I ain't really played with it yet. Not, not really. Um, give me one more. It's time. And then the strength card with the magician. Boom. 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 So once you change your perspective, the eight of wands, you're going to start a new journey. This is this energy is going to pick up quick. You're going to you're going to start to flow more easily. Here is what I'm seeing. You're going to start. Look at the bird. Look at the bird. You're not going to be the wands. You're going to be the bird. OK, um, you're going to start to flow more easily with the nine of wands here. This is something that's like stopping and blocking you from moving forward because you're all up in your head. OK, it's, it's, it's this is a this is not a delay, but you're making it a delay. You're making a delay. Hello. You're making it a delay. Find yourself with the strength card. So this is two eights as well. OK, things need to flow like I'm saying fluidity, um, but you need to find the inner strength in you. You get what I'm saying? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. This came out like this. She has the wand in her hand. Here is the wand in his hand. She has the wand in her hand, but she has to find the strength so she can manifest her true outcome is what I'm saying. Look, look at this. Her true outcome is what I'm saying. You get me? You need to find the strength and then have the strength to manifest because you already have all the tools. This is what the magician is saying. You already have everything you need to create. You already you've already been been through cycles, but now it's time for you to what? Shed your skin from the snake. Thank you. Shed that skin, baby. You can't take that skin with you. This is why you're going through what you're going through. This is why relationships had to end. This is because you're coming because true love is coming. This is why. This is why you had to change your environment because it wasn't healthy. It was toxic. You get what I'm saying? Change your perspective. Accept, accept, ex change your perspective and accept what you got and then move forward is what this is saying. With the emperor at the bottom of the deck. Yes. It's time for you to take control of your life. It's time. It's time. It's time. 
it's time look new moon read back to that it's time <laughs> um yes 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 i'm digging all of this i'm digging it i'm digging it um be the wolf be the wolf whatever that is i just see the wolf here i just zoned in on it so be it whatever that is the animalistic instinct okay um give me five more weekend energy please can i get five more five more weekend energy thank you the queen of pentacles twice it's time for you to nurture you're nurturing you, you were nurturing everyone else now nurture yourself is what they're saying the five of swords stop fighting what you fighting for just you only need one sword that's it the seven of pentacles one more bruh okay the two of swords yeah look i said you only need one sword here it is right here you only need one sword but you still got two you still got your guard up you still you but she, but look how she looking though she looking like she ready she looking like she ready but you only need one sword though and if you are gonna have to at least have one like tucked somewhere don't have it like trying to stop and block you need one of your hands to to like guard and all that you know what i'm saying but and then look the wolf is behind her the wolf is behind her what you ready for you not you your, your focus is in the wrong direction okay your focus is in the wrong direction hear me when i say this it's time for you to take whatever you have left and invest that energy somewhere else it's time for you to start nurturing yourself it's time for you to get out into nature look where she at this is why nature is here because you're coming up as a queen of pentacles it's time for you to get grounded yes it is with the five of swords you had to leave something behind very argumentative narcissistic just i don't even like this fucking card okay but this is what you had to leave behind okay any third party situations, any exterior situationships that was attached to you, it's time for you to leave it behind. Why? And invest your time somewhere else. Nurture something else. Nurture yourself. Plant your seeds. It's time. With the justice card here, karmic cycles is completing. They're wrapping up with the wheel at the top. With the wheel at the top, it's time for forward movement. Yes. But you need to change your perspective. How are you receiving this information? How? judgment is here it's time for you to release forgive surrender it's time it, it you cannot allow this situation to hold you back this situation needs to be the drive that drives you forward listen i posted something on my group the other day and i was saying that um you need to learn how to love yourself during the struggle okay because that person that's not getting love because they struggling they're not paying attention to themselves no you need to take some time out and say you're doing an amazing job you are awesome you are wonderful you are gonna pat you're gonna six you're gonna exceed this understand that feel that in your soul is what this is saying with the judgment card here it's like it's time to release and surrender and allow spirit to work through you fluidity fluidity use that to have you move forward okay listen I'm done preaching to y'all. Let me pull um, some angel answers. And then we're going to wrap this up. Okay? This will be your best advice this week. This will be your best advice. Like I said, for some of you, y'all got somebody wanting to come in and talk to y'all this weekend. And express to you how they really feel. They've been throwing themselves into finances and careers. Or they just had exterior things. Um... You know, keeping them, stopping them, and blocking them from moving forward. But, um, and then a lot of you guys need to change your perspective. How are you receiving information? How are you processing what you're going through? Like, you need to change, you need to change your perspective. Okay? Um, look, let go. Let go. It's time to let it go. Change your mind change your perspective how you're receiving information how you're giving off information because you're manifesting right so we need to pay attention to our thought process because our thoughts is manifesting at a rapid rate into our reality in which we create and control the outcome okay don't forget it yes this situation will improve a peaceful resolution and this situation will improve didn't even come out but i'm telling you whatever your answer is it's a yes okay it's a yes with the exclamation mark like yes duh you didn't know 
but you need to forgive yourself a lot of you guys are battling this is why the healing card is coming out maybe you guys need to listen to music to boost up your confidence your 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 self-esteem or that's gonna really trigger you and put you in a mental space to where you can finally release i don't know your life okay I can only tell you what I see here in the cards. But yes, there will be a peaceful resolution. You need to trust the divine. And what? Listen to your mother love the intuition. Listen to your intuition, okay? And ask your angels. I say this enough. If you ever got to read from me, I tell you. All you have to do is ask. Okay? Give me one more. And then we done. There's something better. Look. Cycles had to end. You had to leave people behind. Situations had to change. You, you, It had to. Because there is something better. You deserve better. You deserve the best. You are the best. So receive this message. There is something better. You, need, you weren't around people who were helping you. You weren't around these type of people. And now the situations that you'll be going to, they're going to be helping you become the best version of you. So maybe you need to surround yourself by people who love and care and appreciate you on a real note. Okay? So, with that being said, that's your weekend reading, loves. I hope you have a great weekend. I know I am. I might pop in on Sunday and do a little Sunday fun day with y'all. But, um, oh yeah, self-love challenge. Start on Sunday. Make sure you have your journal, okay? If you're not in my group, she's the one, capital one, O-N-E, all that's capital, divine and gifted. Um, go ahead and send an invite and uh, love and prosperity to you keep stay focused stay focused i just seen the nine of swords your energy is in the wrong direction change directions change perspective moving forward love y'all oh live your truth know your worth live your truth just be you yes